good morning, good morning. Now, I am getting ready to leave uh, Komorum and I'm gonna go get some food, a cup of coffee and the pennies here and uh, on to the next place. Wish me luck. So, here we go. So this road goes along the, the Duna. I'm looking for the peck shake. Peck shake. The bakery, because there was no coffee. <coughs> uh, so I was in the supermarket and it's really strange because there are the Danones, hey, beautiful, and all the other uh, like familiar brands. Oh, Jesus. Uh, and then there's the local stuff. Oh my god, like all the foreign things, all the European foreign things, they're so expensive. So I got a fiver worth of, uh, of goodies. A yogurt drink, bread, some soft cheese, bar chocolate, there was something else, oh yeah, peanuts, fiver. That'll keep me in, uh, that'll keep me in food for today. And keep me fed for today. Uh, so I've been having issues with the route. I've been trying to avoid the climbing. I wanted to go back to the river. Now that I'm back at the river, it looks like there is no road <laughs> that I can walk on. Uh, so I've changed my mind again I'm going to uh, go to Tata tomorrow from where I'll pick up the Jerusalem way and I'll do short stages with the climbing on the muddy roads and I'll just do it slow slow of course that's not ideal because it's expensive uh, if I do short distances it means I have to sleep more in more different places. I don't, still don't speak any Hungarian, so it's not like I'm going to be hanging out with anybody. Uh, people are a little bit weary. I think there might be some uh, issues. I'm not sure, like, I'm not sure, but... Uh, yeah, they're a little bit weary of me and my pack. I'm trying to focus on the music, but that's not really, that's not really happening the way I thought it was going to. Like, this is Hungary. This is Zoltan Kodai uh, country. Oh, I learned the other day, Zoltan actually means Sultan. Duh. Uh, so I'm doing a zigzag. Uh, I have, I'm in a place where I'm going now. I can't think yet because I haven't had coffee. Uh, I've been invited by the mayor and if I understood it right, I'm sleeping in a museum tonight. <laughs> uh, but he is the only one who got back to me. All the churches, everything else, because it's not part of the pilgrim's path. They're just ignoring me completely, as in they don't answer the phone, they don't answer my emails and they don't answer my messages. So. That means they're either really, really busy with St. Nicholas, which is a big thing here. Like, they have a lot of this kind of stuff going on. Beautiful woodwork, right? Ah, uh, so, what can I do? All I can do is just go on, keep going, and uh, make the best of it. Try and stay warm at night. Yesterday evening as well. Uh, I had to uh, stay in a place that I really thought was too expensive. But, you know, can't sleep out in the cold. It's freezing at night. Now, today, no snow. At first, it looked like it was going to snow for a few days. Uh, I'm seeing a bit of blue up there. Look, a bit blue. So, there's hope yet for me. But it's cold. It's about one degree. It'll get no more than five degrees. 
uh, I've been using my rain gear as a windbreaker, which helps, but when I sweat a lot, it doesn't help. <laughs> then I just get really cold. Yesterday my feet got really wet. That was very uncomfortable. I need new shoes. The sides have gone. The profiles are still holding though. So yeah, bakery now. Uh, the guy from Dunakility, he uh, sent me a, a website for finding uh, places in Hungary to stay. The prices are much, much better than Booking.com. Much, much better. And also, the, uh, there is way more choice because all the small places are on it because it's local. Uh, yeah, I better go find my coffee. I really need coffee. <laughs> what do I like? Like, I should be over this by now. Not everybody has a vice, right? Coffee is my vice. That's okay. Okay, let me go find this. kilometers that has seven and a half kilometers over the the your Velo six so tomorrow if I want to I can take the the bicycle path because they did all of that up here I was over the old part of course earlier but here they've uh, They've done it up. <coughs> Looking good. Easy to walk. Even if I have to climb. Worth looking at, like. Okay. Talk to you later. Oh no, hang on. We never did this thing, like. Hello, hello. Today is day 226 
or from here to Jerusalem. Walking from West Cork to Jerusalem or the harp on your back. Now, closing in on Nesme. Yeah, I learned from Imre, the cyclist, how to pronounce the name. So just as in Kodai, the L Y, the L Y, that is a, a Y. There you go, learned something new. Nesme, they're waiting for me. Or so the mayor said. I'm looking forward to it. St. Nicholas is arriving here today. I'm so excited. Okay. Now, let me finish this. And there was me thinking that I'd arrive early. Look at so this lake used to be a swimming pool. Oh, look. It smells a bit strange. And there is... It looks... Yeah, like there's steam coming off it. The water is warm anyway. So, they've been planting trees here, as you can see. And as I come off the main road to do this last bit, about, uh, I have about uh, two and a half kilometers left to my destination, because of course, that was what I was gonna say as well. Um, you can, uh, you can have like, you can enter a place and that is then in two and a half kilometers and then you still need to get to the other side of that place, which is also two and a half kilometers. So it's always longer than you think. Um, I came off the main road to do this stretch. Uh, and, uh, whew, and then they were working on planting the trees and this man went like, come, come, you gotta come. You have to come, come with me. And I go like, okay. <laughs> so we go inside and there is like his wife and she is making me like sandwiches with lard and <laughs> lard and salt and onions and it was really good. And cups of tea and cups of coffee. So I'm feeling much better now. And uh, I'll arrive just around four. <sighs> Where I need to be just after four, I think. <sighs> and I have a new friend called Gabby. There you go. <sighs> it was lovely meeting you. <laughs> okay, Nesme, here I come. Feeling better than I felt in days, really. Because I had like a normal conversation with a stranger. That is so good. <sighs> okay. Hello, Danube, Duna, Donau. There you are. I've missed you. I like you. Oh, oh it's cold.